Hello guys, Jeffrey speaking here. So today I'm going to do another review of gaming headset. But before I proceed with the video, I would like to ask you a question. Are you looking for a gaming headset to use with your various devices? For example, your gaming PC, your smartphone, your tablet, your PlayStation 4, and even your Xbox. If you are looking for that particular gaming headset, then you should watch this video. First of all, let me show you guys what is inside the box. The first one is the user manuals and then the cable for connecting to your Xbox followed by the cable for your PC and last but not least is the gaming headset itself. When I first put on this headset, I feel that it was a bit small for my head but surprisingly after a few hours of usage, I feel quite comfortable. The clamping force is just nice although it is not as good as Marvel and Edifier headset that I tested before this. But I would still suggest you guys to try it out yourself. And if I want to talk about the flaws, one of them is definitely the build quality. It is very plasticky, starting from the ear cups, headband, and also the hinges. The adjustment level for the hinges is very minimal as well, and it is not that smooth. In terms of flexibility, this headset is the king. I have tried several gaming headsets before, and I have to admit that this is the most flexible one. The ear cups are over ear design, and the cushions are made of faux leather and is quite comfortable. As for the cushions below the headband, it has same issue with my Audio Technica M40X, that is, you will feel pain if you wear it for several hours. The cable is non braided and non detachable, but the issue I have here is the short cable, which is 1.5 meters, and I wish it is around 2 meters. At the end of the cable, it is a 3.5mm audio connector which you can connect to your smartphone, tablet or your PS4 controller. So now I'm going to test out the built-in microphone of this gaming headset. So in terms of quality, I would say it is almost the same with the Marvel headset that I reviewed before this. So if you guys want to check out that review, you can click on the i button on my top left hand side. And the reason why I love this microphone is because uh, the voice is quite clear when I re uh, record using this microphone, but of course you will still hear some background noise. So, what's my verdict on this gaming headset? For me, it is a good buy because you can use it for almost every devices, such as smartphone, tablet, PC, and gaming consoles with reasonable pricing around 120 ringgit Malaysia. But there's one thing that I hope that they can fix, that is the design of the microphone switcher, which is very loose. So that's all for today's video and I hope you guys enjoy it. And if you guys have any gaming headset that you want me to check out, then please leave their names at the comment box below and I'll try to approach the manufacturer. So like usual, thumbs up if you like it, sub if you're new here, and I shall talk to you guys in the next video. Ciao!